There is a new battle at Buckeye Lake over property lines, and some homeowners are frustrated. They're getting letters from the Ohio Department of Natural Resources. Chopper 4 flew over that area earlier today. About a dozen lakefront homeowners are being told to move or pay up. NBC4's Rick Reitzel talked to both sides. After nearly two years of dam construction just outside their back windows, some of these homeowners received letters from the state saying that their property is encroaching onto state lines and it gives them two weeks to either remove it or meet with them and do something about it. Steve Schilling got this letter about a major encroachment on state land with part of his house, steps, and awning four feet over the line. No one out here, I guarantee you, no one did it on purpose. No one came out here and said, I'm going to be on state land. No one thought that they were over on state land. Nobody. Schilling says as many as 212 homeowners have some kind of encroachment. An ODNR spokesman says he anticipates more letters but doesn't know how many. They're talking about a major encroachment, which means a, bit, a chunk of your house coming off. Correct. Could you do that? I just have to tear the house down. There's really, there, that, that's really, that's really not an option. Doug Stewart says he's on a citizen advisory board with ODNR and says he understood the old dam property would not be an issue after the new dam was built. We felt like we should, uh, you know, that the state should. Um, lease this to us or deed it to us with restrictions or whatever where, where all those encroachments would be null and void. ODNR says they'll meet with owners and try to work out compromises, but owners need to make decisions within a couple of weeks. This is a letter from the widow of the former Columbus police chief asking ODNR for leniency, and Schilling says he's asking Governor Kasich to take a stand on this. Local for you in Buckeye Lake, Rick Reitzel, NBC4.